the Minotaur. The Minotaur. The Minotaur. Chapter One: A Deadly Demand. Long ago, a king ruled the city of Athens. One day, he received a terrible letter. Oh no! He sighed. Not again! What shall I do? What's wrong? Asked his son Theseus. King Aegis waved the letter under Theseus' nose. Read this, he moaned. To King Aegis of Athens, send fourteen of your people to me by the end of the month. Sighed, King Minos of Crete. P.S. I want seven men and seven women. P.P.S. If you don't do th- as I ask, there will be trouble. I don't understand. Every nine years, King Minos demands fourteen people from Athens. Said Aegis, "What for?" He sends them into a giant maze called the Labyrinth. Sounds fun," said Theseus. "Fun," spluttered his father. "At the heart of the lady, labyrinth, as a minotaur. What's a minotaur? It's a terrible creature." Aegis shivered. "It's half man, half bull, and it eats people." Chapter two. Theseus has a plan. What can I do? I have an idea," said Theseus. "I'll be one of the seven men." "Are you crazy?" said his father. "The Minotaur will eat you alive." "Don't worry, Dad," said Theseus. "I'm the best sword fighter in Athens." Aegis sighed. "Even if you kill the monster, no one has ever escaped the lady labyrinth." I'll find a way out somehow," said Theseus confidently. King Aegis begged his son not to go, but it was no use. Theseus boarded a ship with the others. Aegis was still very worried. If Theseus survives, he said to the sailors, "Fly white sails on the ship when you return." Chapter Three, Island of Danger. Wind filled the ship's sails. Theseus and the others were on their way. Before they arrived at Crete, Theseus hid his sword under his clothes. Soldiers were waiting for them as they docked. Follow us to the palace. Welcome, Lord King Minos. Enjoy your last meal. At dawn, you enter the labyrinth. Guards took the prisoners away. They locked them in a dark, dank dungeon. That night, Ariadne, Ariadne, the king's daughter, took them bread and water. Oh, he is nice. As soon as he saw Theseus, Ariadne fell madly in love. I can't let you spend the rest of your life in the labyrinth, she whispered. Then help me to kill the Minotaur and escape, said Theseus. Ariadne thought for a moment. Very well, she said. If you promise to marry me, go. All right, Theseus agreed nervously. Take this ball of magic stream," said Ariadne. "Stream, stream, tie it to the entrance of the labyrinth as you go in. Then what?" asked Theseus. "You'll see," smiled Ariadne.